What's going on guys? Um, if you watched my last video, you knew that the ice was getting fairly sketchy. Um, it has gotten relatively thin. Most of the lake has blown off. But I want to try to go fishing this weekend. So I got a buddy of mine and his daughter. We are going out to a couple spots to check the ice and see exactly how thick it is and whether or not it will be safe enough to fish come Sunday. We've had a lot of warm temperatures and it's going to be above freezing until about midday tomorrow and then it's supposed to drop down overnight. It's supposed to be relatively cold and then Sunday we're supposed to have some cold temps so here's to hoping we have some good ice. We'll see you guys in a bit. You're at the first spot and so far not looking too hot. Broken up at the shore. Looks like it might be thicker as you get out, but we're going to try to see if we can get out there. Not looking too promising so far. Looks like most spots are uh, pretty broken up at shore, so trying to get out there. Not going to be too easy. Luckily over here is fairly low, so maybe we can get out on it over here. Water level drops a lot during the winter so there's a lot of uh, a lot of shallow spots That's what we're looking at. Not very thick. Looks like this spot's not going to be a go-to spot. We got a couple more spots to check, and then we will uh, make a decision. in there.
getting there. I don't know if I trust it all that much though. how thick it is about four inches very honeycombed though not the greatest ice spud bar breaks through relatively easily and it's cracking out from underneath me Time to go check a different spot. Okay, we are at the next spot. And so far, all I see is what looks like open water. So, I have a feeling this spot won't be locked up for a while. But I'm gonna walk down and check it out, just in case. No, that is open water. Certainly open water. All right, we got one more spot to check, and that is the spot that I had guessed to be the best spot for trying to get out this weekend and fish. So we are gonna hop back in the truck, and head on over there, and check out the ice over there. Okay, guys, we're at the third and final destination. Um, looking like. We're on the east end of the lake, so all the wind blows this way, and uh, most of the ice is probably going to be piled up on the shoreline. So if we're going to have good ice, this is going to be where it's at. So we'll see if we can spud out and get onto it, see how bad it is. Build up on shore. Okay, that's wet. All right, we're going to try to get on from the beach rather than off the rock ledge. Does not look very ideal. Luckily, it's not very deep. access point. I do not think that it's going to be all that bad. seems to be fairly thick. Most spots seem to be six inches or more. And now it's too dark to see anything. But looks like fishing is going to be a go. We'll see what happens. Okay guys, so we're back at home. Um, it's looking like our best option is down at the east end of the lake. Um, we had four inches of ice maybe 
Um, uh, there's supposed to be some more warm weather tomorrow, and then supposed to get down in the freezing. So hopefully, come Sunday, we will be out getting some more film done. Right now, I'm setting everything up, getting all my stuff on the chargers, and getting everything packed up and ready to go. And hopefully, we'll be out on Sunday, and we'll uh, we'll catch you guys then.